Good morning. Welcome to Book Date with You, the platform where we recommend the best book to you. So today is episode 71, and we are going to recommend this book to you, The Ultra Mind Solution by Dr. Mark Kaiman. Um, who is Dr. Mark Kaiman? Um, he is an American family physician, a 10 time number one New York best selling author, and international recognized leader, um, speaker, educator, and advocate in his field. So he's director of Cleveland Clinic uh, Center of Functional Medicine, and he's also the founder of uh, and medical director of the Ultra Wellness Center. He believes that we all deserve a life of vitality and that we have the potential to create it for ourselves. So we'll pass to Joyce to talk about content. Yes, I am so in love with this book. And Dr. Mark Kerman definitely is my mentor along my journey about wellness, especially about nutrition. And today this book talks about the Ultramind solution. Let's directly go into the content. I'm so, so um, uh, excited to share with you is about this. We talk about broken brain. Broken brain is the epidemic that the brain actually break down that shows in a radically different way from person to person. For example, some people may experience depression, right? Anxiety, memory loss, brain fog, ADHD, which is the attention deficit disorder, autism, or, and also dementia. Look at that. It's like the broken brain it manifests in a different way. And this is the things that we want to talk about today. How about the brain? And I'm so obsessed about brain function and also how to optimize my brain um, performance since last year. This is always, always my passion to learn about this. And now I want to share with you about this book. So look at that. I give you an example that Dr. Mark Hyman mentioned in his book is talking about depression. Depression, it comes from the profound omega-3 deficiency, omega-3 fatty acid deficiency, and also a lack of vitamin B12, low functioning thyroid, and also a chronic mercury toxicity. That can really is the underlying cause of the depression. And a lot of time you will see that doctor, they give antidepressant and also, <clears throat> and also the psychiatric medication, they don't cure the problem. Then you see that it is a time that they cover up the symptom. They give you the antidepressant and also the psychiatric medication, just like the sweep the dust under the carpet. And it, it doesn't look like the dust is there, but actually the dust is still there. You just cover up the symptoms. You need to go and check it out the underlying causes because your entire body, it's just like a, all the core system that interact like a single sophisticated symphony. You know, you can't separate your organ. For example, your heart, your liver, your intestine, your brain, it is actually, you have to see yourself as a whole person. We are human. It's not just about, you know, separate heart, then another separate liver, another separate intestine, or even your bones. So that's the reason why I want to talk to you about your body and your mind are actually connected, right? All this thing, information you can get directly from this book. It's like what you do to your body, you do to your brain too. When you heal your body, you heal your brain. That's like your body is directly, um, I would say directly um, influences the brain. And for example, what are the things that can influence all this? Is from the nutritional status, hormonal imbalances, food allergies, toxins, digestive and also immune metabolic imbalance together with uh, all this can influence our mood, our attitude, and also our behavior and attention. So we want to really check it out because Dr. Mark Hyman, he believes so much that you should, and definitely you can feel alert, focused, energizing, unstressed, and definitely mentally sharp. <clears throat> and right now, this book, teach you the key, how you can care for your brain, how you can care for your body. The goal is for all of you that you can live your life that you meant to live. 
That is the key for this book and a life that's full of energy, vitality, pleasure, and also happiness. Let's talk about the key in this book. Before we jump into the seven keys, let's go to this one is the approach of the ultra wellness um, solution is first, we want to remove what irritates you. Remove what irritates you is to take out all the toxins from your body. Remember that we want to, to check it out. What are the things that really irritates you? They can be have a lot of things because in this 21st century, we have so many different things that can input from a food, water, air, environment that really can cause a lot of um, contaminant and toxins in our body. That's why we want to remove all this toxin. First step. Second step is this one, mm. is to add in the good stuff. For example, all the nutrients, vitamins, minerals, and ingredients that help your body to thrive. That is the two step. It's very important. And it is very differ from person to person. That's why you need to work together with a functional medical doctor or the nutritionist to figure it out. Because success is not possible if not all the factors are addressed. You need to check this out. So now let's go directly to this seven key. Yes, the first key. I will share the first six key. I will love the last key to get it. So get it, we'll check it out in the last key. So the first key is about the optimized nutrition. And I'm a big fan and to talk about nutrient intake because we are made from the things that we eat. Definitely can see that. Our biology, biochemistry, and also our physiology, uh, we need certain raw material to help us to run optimally. So for example, we need all the vitamins, minerals. When we talk about essential fatty acids, all the EPA, DHA, check this out. It's so essential for your brain to function optimally. Second, all types of amino acids, folate, B12, B6, magnesium, zinc, and also vitamin D. All these things is a very, very essential uh, nutrients that you need to take notes on that so much. And definitely you want to eat it through your whole foods, your real foods. And I always, uh, learn from Dr. Mark Hyman is remember, eat the food that has is real, which you can see the leaves, you can see the stem, you can see the tuber, all this is real. And definitely it is so helpful to, to intake all these different uh, phytonutrients. Because I stay in a lab for the last time for almost like five years to really know about all these phyto nutrients in the plant, which is I'm so obsessed to know how they impact our human nutritional um, uh, status. So that's why I really encourage you to really eat plant-rich food diet. Plant-rich, at least 70% of your meal is made up of your plant, all the different, different plants with a different color pigments right there. Second key, balance your hormone. Let's talk about hormones a little bit while. Your hormone, for example, like insulin, your thyroid hormone, your sex hormone, your stress hormone, and many, many more. Whether it's in balanced state or not, to really take care of your health, most of us, we don't know, right? We don't know. So for me, how I know, do a blood test. I just only of this year, I go through a hormone test to test it out whether it's my hormone balance or not. If not, what are the hormone I need to optimize, right? So how I need to do that, I need to talk to the functional medical doctor to really get myself in a balanced state. And I encourage you, if you haven't done your hormone test yet, go and run one at least to see what is your baseline right now. Okay, the third key we want to talk about is cool off the inflammation. So you know that we all, our body, we 
how would I say, our body naturally know how to protect us and defend us from all the foreign invaders or the, the, the abnormal cells that come to us. That is really helpful that our body will create that information to kick off all the, the foreign materials that come to us. But the chronic inflammation that happened in our body definitely can cause a lot of illness and definitely does not helpful for your brain. If you have all this, just now I mentioned, anxiety, depression, ADHD, autism, dementia, brain fog, memory loss, means that your brain is a broken brain and is definitely inflamed. You want to check this out. And I'm not sure about you, you may, experience that a lot of people start to tell you recently, especially, I don't know why, I get so many people tell me about this. They, they have this inflamed stomach, inflamed heart, and I, wow, that's hard to check it out. It just to better take care of yourself. It is so many different ways to cool off the inflammation that is the Third key that we talk about. So we go to the fourth key, which is my favorite. It speaks to your digestion. It's like, remember the GI tract? Our gastrointestinal tract means from our mouth, our esophagus to our stomach, and then to our small intestine, large intestine, and then to our rectum to become stool to pass it out. That is our GI tract. You see, from the digestion, we are... Our GI tract is taking care of digesting the food and absorbing the food and assimilating the nutrients that is critical for our health. That's why anything that breaks off in any part of this, your body will definitely experience uh, some of the illness along the journey. So just want to check it out is take care of your gut, your GI tract, definitely so helpful for you to take care of your brain. That's the key number four. Key number five is talking about enhanced detoxification. Enhanced detoxification, our liver, our kidney. You see, we, our body, we have waste. We want to eliminate through our stool and our urine. That's the big two. So a lot of time in this 21st century, we have the all different kind of contaminant toxins from our food, our water that we consume, our air that we're breathing, all this is really going to cause a lot of toxin in our body. We want to help our body to take care of that toxin, to eliminate through our metabolic wastes. That is the key number five. The last two keys I will share with the, the key number six is about boosting the energy metabolism. We talk about energy. Life is energy. You can't live without energy. It's just like if you don't have energy, you die. Literally. Because the process of extracting, you, because in, in our life, it's like it's a process we're extracting the energy coming from the food and also the air, the, the oxygen that we're breathing that is so vital, crucial for our own health, our own you know, body function. So when you want to keep your energy metabolism running smoothly, that's one of the big, big key that you want to take care of. So there is so many ways that Dr. Mark Hyman mentioned in this book. And I want to pause to get in to share about the key number seven, which is the last key. Um, get in, you are muted. Oh, sorry. The key number seven is about calm your mind. Um, I, I think Joyce talked a lot about health set. And it's also important that we need to look at our heart set, you know. Um, it's not just our flesh, but our heart, right? And, um, and your mind. Um, and the life of meaning and purpose is a life in balance with connection, your community, your love, your support, and a sense of empowerment is, is essential for health. We, we human are you know, social animal, right? We, we need connections. And I think it's, it's all back to the, the word love, you know, love for other people, love for the society, of course, love for yourself. Like what we talked 
um, and, and the six key is all about yourself, but also you need to you know look beyond yourself, you know, look at the community, the society. And because of this, you, you, you want to help other people and other people want to help you. This is how you get support. And um, unfortunately, nowadays, you know, in, 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 in the life we live right now, there's a lot of uh, issues like social isolation. We are all overworked. Yeah, this empowerment. Mm -hmm. We have a sure, lot of strengths, right. you know. Yeah, and, and then we, a lot of people burn out or, or break down. So, so we need to look at this and and try to look beyond yourself because all this will help you to build your your gratitude and your love for other people. When you love for other people, you you will feel that your your mom your your your, your mind is 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 calm. It, it will definitely be it will definitely become calm. And you know, together with what we shared just now, with your health, that you have a, a good body, you have a, a energy, then you have a good mind. Then of course you will become a, a better, you know, a person. You know, yeah, in this world. So yeah, this is what I shared on the last one. Yeah. Yes. Thank you so much. This is like um, a a book that is published, I think, two thousand nine. I think more than ten years ago. To see all the information is definitely still very very valid until today it is not about saying that you will be outdated and definitely i want you to check it out because there are so many great um information that you can extract out from this book and practice in your daily lives and let us know what is the one key takeaway from our session and leave your comments below and see you all in the next session Thanks. Bye-bye.